Cambodian food, man, hits different. Really hits different. Mm. It's a, uh, it's beautiful. Yeah. Ooh, yes, sir. Rice. Who said my chopstick game ain't, ain't on point? <laughs> Okay. Oh, pork belly on rice every time. Yeah, yeah. but you can't go past the the roti with the peanut sauce as well. Oh, yeah, just for no, those golden. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye -bye. Yeah. Bye bye. <laughs> Look at these houses over here. These really old Victorian houses. See that? How good is that? How much are in the I don't know. A couple of millions here. Right. Yeah. For being in Oriental Bay. That's it. Wait, what flag is that? Swiss flag. That's a flag of Switzerland. Okay. Let's go knock on their door so they got some Swiss uh, chocolates at home. Okay. <laughs> so we're on to the next spot. Come out here. A man on the summer love. Right, what's up people? Because I can channel. Yeah. We're here in the Wellington City. And we're just going for a cruise down here. Now we're heading Oriental Bay here. A beautiful part of the city. So if you've never been to Wally, if you ever come to Wellington, it's a really cool place to go and um, come and have a look. It's really nice. Look at this. I just love I just love the vibes of the city. You know, when I was in Australia, every time you're having a bad day. And things like that you think of uh, your happy place this is one of my happy places is uh oriental bay around this way because it's such a good great vibes you know oh look at that this is mr trans am old school trans am but today we're just going you know freestyling this content bring to you guys right. sort of um what we do around the city right. so fortunate to live in this beautiful place and we just that's what yeah, we do every day exactly baby. we are you know we're very grateful to be living in wellington great place to grow up in great place to live and you know the vibes are always on 100. so we're just driving up courtney place this is courtney place people so for those people familiar with wellington city courtney place has changed a lot in the last 15 years. Still a vibrant street. Oh, and right here on my left is KC Cafe. Bro, those guys got the got the mean feeds. Feeds they are hectic. They are lefty and lefty. So like I said, thank you and welcome to the channel. All is good to have you people watching this um, content. This is Tory Street. See there. Okay, let's find a park over here. In front. There's a park in front here. We got park. Now, man, we're down here in the city checking out the food trucks. This is the second part of our episode for today. The first part's already been. The second part's about Cambodian food. So I've been to this place here. It's off Tory Street and in Wellington. Now this place is called K and K Cambodian Caravan. One of the better food trucks in the city. This one, the food is hectic, believe me. So we're gonna go check these guys out, see what's up. Hello. Hi, how are you? Good. So this is Cambodian food. Yes, sir. And today we're gonna to have some great food, right? Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all is bossing up on this channel, bringing you really good um, spots here in Wellington. These are the spots that you people probably go past all the time and miss. So we're giving you guys the hidden gems in Wellington. And you won't be disappointed, people. <laughs> yeah, in my country, the yeah. locha, they do normally a uh, green shark. Okay. Yeah, and um, with the um, bean sprout. Okay. Yeah, and egg on top. That's what we do in Cambodia. That's but a lot cha. Yes, that's a lot cha. Because in here, they some people they not don't like the bean sprout. Okay. Yeah, and the chives as well smell not nice. 
That's why we, we don't do much. We do in a season, you know, VG fifth season as well. The couch okay. fairy sometimes have a, a lot, sometimes not. So that's why we use the green leaf, like um, mesclet. Okay. Yeah, to, to make it green. <laughs> And a lot of Cambodia people they come support and they, they ask for egg on top. Like oh, yeah, yeah. In Cambodia. I yes. like your yeah, egg on yeah. top. Yes. <laughs> we always do special as well. <laughs> How's it going, mate? Oh, I'm good, thank you. How are you? Oh, good. Well, what's your name? Chris. Chris. Now, are you regular at this spot? I am regular at this spot. Okay, what's your go-to meal here? Oh, pork belly on rice every time. Yeah, yeah. but you can't go past the, the roti with the peanut sauce as well, oh, just yeah, for no, those cold days, yeah. So, um, on a one to 10, give us a rating for this for, place. For this 11, see, I work just here and every day I come down here and this is the smell that draws George you in straight away. Yeah, yeah exactly, just, look yeah. at that. <laughs> this you. place, yeah, <laughs> this place is hectic, guys. So, <laughs> So you recommend all Wellingtonians need to know about this oh, place, Oh, 100%, right? 100%. Well, we all come down from work just to come and, come and get lunch here, so, yeah. Okay, thank you for that. No trouble at all. Cheers, hey. brother. You're good. Okay, yeah. Cheers. There you have it. <laughs> hey, guys, as we always do, we, um, we've asked the owner if we can come and film her, you know, doing the magic. So we're here. This is what we do here. We're inside the truck, as you can see. Hello, say hello. Hi, hi, how are you? What's hello. your name? My name is Kira Chia. And this is, uh, this is a ca Cambodian uh, food truck <laughs> here, and they're always over here in the same spot. This spot is uh, off Tory Street, right across from Bunnings. Then, you, you can I always catch this food truck here. The food's amazing. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, we, the... we probably can't show you everything because we don't want to let the secret out. <laughs> but this is uh, here, we're in the Magic Walk doing. Um, let her do her thing. I mean, it's always a privilege and grateful that people allow me to come and film them while they're working and doing the food. Big shout out to all my people in Cambodia or Khmer out there. I salute you guys. And um, so look, outside there, time is drooling. Right. There, can't wait. But um, on Facebook and Instagram, it's called the KK Food Caravan. Okay, we will we will be putting the, the link to the to this uh, to this thing. We'll, we'll put the link on the on the um, pages on um, on the video. So just added some uh, cabbages in there. Man, believe me, people. I mean, the smell, the aroma of the food, amazing. It is the business. Believe me. Yeah, about put it into the to the trays. I can smell sweet. Look at that. Woo -hoo. Yes, oh yes, sir. It is happening. I'm hungry, man. <laughs> Amazing, we're bringing you the food truck series from here in Wellington and make sure you pull up and support these people and their business because that's the reason why we do these videos, just showing you people places that you might have missed that you probably walk past this food truck millions of times and never check them out but now I'm telling you guys, you need to come check these people out. The brisket is, is cooking there and over here, what's this one? Pork belly. Oh, it's so you can see the pork belly and the gravy and the gravy look at that <laughs> I know oh I choice. <laughs> yes Ooh, we're right down in 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 <laughs> where it's all happening oh the sauce oh yum oh believe me the video if only you can get the smells of this because it is the, the aroma of the food is so exquisite Oh, I haven't used my exquisite in a long time. <laughs> and this, oh, look at that. Mm. Now this is the, the uh, beef uh, brisket. So you can see that, look. Straight off the pan and straight down there. Look at that. 
Ooh, yes, sir. <laughs> so how, how long you guys been here in um in this um Torres Street? Yeah, Torres Street. Um, I think it's about two years now. Oh, two years. Two years. Yes. Okay, nice. Well, I'm gonna tell the people to come. Make sure you come down here. Uh, Wait, we'll tell you. them later, homie. <laughs> And we got some salad on the side. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go out. So I'm gonna step outside now. Um, thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, it was getting hot inside inside there, but the food looks delicious, so can't wait. So check this out. So yeah, guys, now we've got the food, and let me show you the food. Looks amazing. So here's the food here. So I got the brisket. That's the brisket here. Beautiful salad and rice fried rice and this here is the pork um what was this pork belly pork belly with uh, rice with fried rice and salad and as you can see my man's trenched it in um <laughs> chili it's like he's got chili on chili you okay sweat today. you know exactly it's gonna be like this dude's gonna eat chili it's gonna be like, you know, till you wanna make you sweat until you sweat no more. That's it. Bit of uh, yeah, you know the song people I know, don't lie, you got the song in your playlist. And looking forward to this, brother? I, I am man. I'm a bit looking worried forward. about how much chili I put on there, but um, you know, I'm 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 actually very hungry, so yeah. Okay, so we we are gonna dig into the into the food. We also got the roti with peanut sauce. As you can see that roti with peanut sauce, yum. Oh, this is a treat, people. We are gonna, we're gonna feast today. A lot of food to do, a lot of food to, to, to eat. So this is the roti. You can see the roti with peanut sauce. Yummy. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and um, we'll tell the people. We'll put your link on um, of, of the of the food truck. On the screen so people can come and check you out thank you very much thank you very thank much you. Bye -bye. yeah bye bye <laughs> yes about to do some serious eating now people <laughs> so there's thomas trying his uh, his food cambodian pork belly cambodian um, extra oh. spice yeah, let's get the what do you want me because yeah. the light okay what do you got there brother this is cambodian pork belly yeah with rice and a assortment of salads i got extra chili and chili flakes yeah Bon appetit. Mm. Okay. Oh, mate. If you're in Wellington and you don't know about this little place, you better know. You'd get to know. Exactly. Beautiful, tender, succulent, very sweet. There's some sweet. Um, they must use some kind of sweet cinnamon stuff or something. Okay. something in it. Yeah, people. Got our our food now this is um, the brisket on rice is the brisket there oh yes oh wow so tasty and man it's, it's like slow cooked the the meat just like so so soft and it's like second day boil up meat. Mm. Mm. Wow. And good thing, they give you a really good portion. Mm -hmm. For a good price. How's that? Beautiful, man. Yeah. I love different cultured foods. I like hot food. Yeah. Highly recommended. Highly. I don't eat Cambodian food a lot. Yeah. And it's good to find a little tuck shop hidden away. Yeah. Get some authentic food in us I mean the rice look at this the rice guys the rice who said my chopstick game ain't, ain't <laughs> on point I'm the wow Mary guy with the fork but leave a leave a comment if you think cause should spice it up a bit more put some more chili in there okay so that's um the brisket there mm. Oh. Out the way, man, and show the people this meat. Pork belly, people. Succulent. 
Ooh. Put a dipping sauce in there. Go back. Mm. Mm. Right, it says it's beautiful. Food is amazing. Cambodian food. Never tried Cambodian cuisine. They said the meat is so succulent, soft, slow cooked. The rice is done just right. Salad. Mm. And the thing here, what I want to show you people is the roti with the peanut sauce. So the peanut sauce is in there. We're trying the, the roti peanut sauce. That's right, man. This guy's straight into it. <laughs> mm. Wow. Man, this is boss. Hectic. Hectic. Bro. For our Moldy viewers, too mecky. <laughs> Crispiest roti I've ever had. Game over. <laughs> Game over. This mm. is amazing. Taste is. Guys, we're not just playing up to the video. <laughs> this is. Where I'm basically dancing and eating at the same time. These guys have got the flavors. The peanut sauces. Man, it's hard to describe. How would you describe the peanut sauce? It's not. It's not just peanut. You're thinking you're just going to get peanut butter, but no, 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 no. It's got like a a sweet sauce in there. Mm. It's quite an oily texture. Beautiful. But the roti by itself, no sauce. Awesome right. day today. Great day today. Great day to be out vlogging and giving you guys content. So thank you for watching as always. Stay in the boss lane. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. And salute from your mans. Because I can. <laughs>